Sam Altman wants to deploy 250 gigawatts of compute by 2033, and Elon Musk fired back saying that XAI, his AI company, will be the first to deploy 10, 100, and 1 terawatt worth of energy. These are absolutely absurd amounts of compute, and I want to walk you through exactly how crazy these ambitions are. If OpenAI's plans played out, they'd be consuming as much energy as a large modern developed country. Only India, the US, and China would likely be consuming more energy than they would. Right now, the US consumes about 4.5 million gigawatt hours of energy per year. This has gone up from 4 million over the last 25 years and about a 21,000 gigawatt hours per year pace. To meet the energy demands of OpenAI and XAI, the U.S. will have to essentially double energy capacity by 2033. It's not quite double, but it's pretty close. You can see here in the graph, this is what the gray bar is the baseline of what the U.S. likely would produce if they kept to current trend lines. The purple line is just if OpenAI was growing at the rate that they indicated they would. And the pink line is the energy demands if both OpenAI and XAI were growing compute at the scale that they were expecting to. Assuming that the United States production and consumption of electricity stayed relatively constant and it grew at that 21,000 gigawatt hours per year number, then by 2033, the combined usage of OpenAI and XAI could be close to 40% of the total U.S. energy consumption. For this to happen, XAI and OpenAI will obviously have to do something to be able to produce the energy that they're going to be consuming. Most data centers have an on-site power plant of some sort. Maybe this will be nuclear in the future. It's likely going to have to be something of the sort to enable this type of power consumption. It will require a energy renaissance in the United States to be able to grow at this rate. It is, it is really just a tremendous if you want more AI insider analysis like this, then subscribe to our newsletter at firstloop.ai slash subscribe. Thank you.